Uh, ladies and gentlemen, the year is just. As of today, all Ghanaian Aramari and Olua Samlari have been granted bail. Police all hold them, you don't tire them. They don't do investigation, find a similar investigation, they go nowhere. The time when police ask from the courts, say they want to hold them, they for that investigation. The time don't pass. So the courts have no other choice than to grant the two of them bail. They have been granted bail in 20 million naira and three shorties. And then they go drop their passport, they go drop this, they go drop that, so that we know go yes, they don't run. They don't come for the go investigation. And then they'll be going to a party every week to help the police further with their investigation until they will be discharged and acquainted or they'll be proven guilty. This is the news. A magistrate court in Yaba, Lagos State, has granted popular singer Aziz Fashola, aka Naira Mali, and music promoter Balogun Eletu, popularly known as Samlari Bail. The bail is in the sum of 20 million with three shorties. Magistrate Adiola Alatubasu also ordered the suspect to submit their passport and report weekly to the Criminal Investigation and Intelligence Department, CRID, as, Pansi, as part of the bail conditions. Naramali and Samlari were arrested and arraigned by the police following an investigation into their alleged involvement in the death of fellow artist Ilerio Lua Olajdemeji Aluba, popularly known as Mubad, who died on September 12, 2023. I have said this before, and I go still talk him again. So that you go to deal on record, say I talk him. Not be say, when it happened now, so people go act surprised. On this Mubad issue, Naramali and Samlari will walk away and nothing will happen. Because the truth is not be the killer. Mobad lost his life based on the truth. Now I'll tell you now, from what we are seeing now, Mobad lost his life based on personal issues and um, carelessness on his part, his part of his family and everybody that we are doing that day. How did they go and get a nurse? That is not even enough to treat somebody who is sick. Don't be saying you broke or go say you're not here for the hospital. Now we are hearing that there was a fight. Unless that fight is linked to Naira Mali, then it will walk away. But if that fight is linked to Naira Mali, he's in trouble. But from the look of things we are seeing now, Naira Mali are not in that fight. From the, the handwritings on the wall. Now, was Nayamali guilty of anything bad? Yes, he was guilty of a lot of things. Bullying a young man, Mobad, is not the right attitude to go. They bullied that boy, they fought him, but that was not what killed him. That guy, when Mobad died, again, many things we never know. We they never tell us. So police, when they investigate, they find out that these things totally don't related with Nayamali. And Samlari will release them. The only things that we have to answer for is bullying. The question is, what is the penalty for bullying in Nigeria? All this war police they do now, courts they do now, is because they don't want to offend the Nigerian people who want somebody to pay for the death of Mubad. And somebody is supposed to pay for it. But Mubad has his own part to play, which he did not play well. At my age, me when I never even get money. So my malaria do me. I know one year say one person and not speak because give me a gesture for us. In fact, if I go hospital, to him, they can say men not give me a gesture. If I look the nonsense, I don't trust them. I will request for another one. Some of us, the way we they risk our life, and we they do like say we get another one, we will keep for us. And it is totally not fair. When something bad happens, I will call the Allah justice for this, justice for that. It's good to shout justice for this, justice for that. But he who comes to equity must come with clean and open hands. So in a day that even the person who died has his own mistake to play, his family has their own mistake to play, we cannot crucify one man or two people for it. Now this will sign as a warning. So everybody went to see they get power, then they find who they go press up at that. I don't know, I see what your oppression do now, Amalia and Samlari. You think that you build the whole country. You are powerful, you are God. You want to oppress people 
No man is all powerful. One day, that your oppression, when you oppress people, will cash up with you. The way Naramali and Samla will you cash up with them. They are lucky they have given them bail. The bail is just with three shorties. And the news did not say shorties in likes of, which means those three shorties does not even need to have money. Once Naramali can drop 20 million, Samla can drop 20 million, they are going to drop their passport. The only problem is they cannot travel. But they will continue their life and I will die and I lose. Ladies and gentlemen, brothers, I beg. Secure your life. Your health and your life comes first. Very important.